How's it going, everybody? Thank you for tuning in to YTX News. I'm Mandoreen. Today, I want to take a look at a little channel that's been, quote-unquote, blowing up lately. And The Verge and USA Today are saying this channel is going to overthrow the king of YouTube, PewDiePie himself. Now, this channel is called Ryan's Toys Reviews, and it only has 5 million subscribers. But for about the past eight weeks, it's apparently been the number one trending channel on YouTube. And I thought it was pretty interesting. I saw PewDiePie did a video called The Five-Year-Old That Will Surpass PewDiePie. This video got 4.2 million views at the time I made this video. That video has 409,000 likes. Meanwhile, Ryan's Toys Channel has a video that has 11 million views with only about 9,000 likes, which just doesn't add up. PewDiePie's video, 4.2 million, with 409,000 likes so far. Ryan's Toys, 11 million views, only 9,000 likes. And you go video after video, and the dislike bars are way bigger than the like bars. It just doesn't add up, and you look into the comments section, and there's a bunch of gibberish. I mean, literally, it looks like people just hitting random keys on their keyboard. It could be little kids or something watching these videos on their parents' iPads or something like that. Or, But it, it's just so common. I mean, how many of these, how many times does that happen where it's like a random comment gets submitted? I mean, it's just very odd. So I have some of the screenshots here of those random comments. I don't know, is this, is this channel buying their views from somewhere? It seems like there's something shady involved. Maybe these little kids don't know how to hit the like button, but I mean, how many of these kids would be able to pull up the video to begin with without the help of their parents? And I just, it's very bizarre. I think it's worth looking into. So if anybody has any information about this channel, how they may be going about getting tens of millions of views, and how USA Today and The Verge cover this story without really having any solid evidence or information as to why. What's behind the success of this channel? There's plenty of toy channels on YouTube that aren't getting the views, and I just the, there's no production quality in this channel. Basically, all it is is this woman who's exploiting her child uh, with a Walmart sponsorship, probably, to show off these toys, and it's very boring. I mean, I know I'm not the target demographic, but I just don't see anybody being like, oh, I gotta go check out the new Ryan's Toys reviews. I'm gonna go watch this spoiled little kid chew a giant gummy, like a giant gumball. Like, what's the, what's the point? So anyways, hopefully we'll hear some news on this. I mean, there's an off chance that maybe people really do want to see this guy open hatch animals or whatever the hell they're called. <laughs> but I'd like to hear what you guys think about this channel down below. Let me know. Anyways, this is Dan with YTX News. Have a great day. We'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.